Hello and welcome to the Foley Society Reviews. Today I will show you our Connecticut Yankee in King Arthur's Court by the American humorist Mark Twain. The book was published in 1889 and it is a satire of feudalism and monarchy. This book, uh, which I haven't read yet, I got this one for free uh, a couple of months back, but it is bound in buckram with a design by David Hughes, who has done some other works for the Foley Society. I think uh, the Foley Society describes this book as uh, having a cloth binding, uh, but this is uh, absolutely a buckram uh, bound book. So here we have the front cover. With the use, very interesting art style. It's maybe not for everyone, uh, definitely not and I'm not sure if I will keep this book myself. But here we have the spine. You can see the castle here making up the letters of Yankee. And here is the back cover. And if you open up the book, it reveals the complete image. And here are the end papers, uh, not just blank end papers this time. We get some uh, characters here, but otherwise they're very blood red and it is a thick paper. And here we have the title page with the frontispiece by Mark Hughes. The book is introduced by Fred Kaplan and illustrated, like I said, by David Hughes. And this book was first published by the Full Society in 2013. And here we have the copyright page and we can see that they have printed the book on Abbey Road paper and it's printed and bound in Germany. And here are all of the contents for the book. And we get an introduction and a preface and here are the remaining chapters. And here is the list of illustrations. There are 10 in total, and I will of course show all of them in this video. And here starts the introduction. And the introduction by Fred Kaplan is six pages long. Here's the preface, uh, just one page. And then the uh, book begins. Now the text size is quite large. It's uh, definitely s uh, about medium in size. And the Abbey uh, Wall paper is very uh, cream colored and actually very thick also. So great job with the paper. And the paper used for the illustration is a textured, very thick paper, a photographic paper. It reminds me of Modigliani paper uh, that full society tend to use for the illustrations. But the colors look nice, but there is definitely some bleed through on the paper. But now let's check out all of the wonderful and interesting illustrations by David Hughes. Enjoy.
and in total this book is 330 pages long. The end papers at the back are exactly the same as the one you get at the front. And here we can see the Smithson binding with the red and black headband and the spine is rounded. And the paper used is of course acid free pH neutral, uh, but the book opens up somewhat well. It's uh, still a quite a big book for being uh, just over 300 pages, but yeah, the book opens up uh, somewhat well, no complaints. And with the book you get a slip case of course, trusty cardboard slip case, uh, and this is in a red color. And this is the new section that I want to include in uh, most of my uh, videos, maybe not all of them, uh, but I want to uh, show how the book looks like on uh, your bookshelf. So here is the book on the shelf and this is what you will see. <laughs> And that was the review of a Connecticut Yankee, Connecticut, Connecticut, Connecticut Yankee in the King Arthur's Court by Mark Twain. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the review and found it helpful. And if there are any specific books you want to see reviewed in the near future, just leave a comment and tell me uh, which book you want to see. And I will try my best to make a video review uh, in the upcoming weeks or at least in the upcoming month. But if you have any questions about this book or any other book in my collection, then please leave a comment and I will answer it as quickly as I can. And if you want to support this channel, you can do so in two ways. You can either go to my Patreon page, which you will find down in the down in the description or up here. And you can also use my Tashin affiliate link if you want to get some beautiful books from the German art publishers and today Full Society will release their summer collection. I'm very excited for that. But thank you all so much for watching and I hope I will see you all next time. Goodbye.